Recently, Osho State Governor Boiga Oyetola signed the Violence Against Person Prohibition Bill, widely campaigned for by his wife, Mrs. Kafayat Oyetola, into law. <laughs> to complement this and commemorate International Day of the Girl Child, Osho State Ministry of Women, Children and Social Affairs is teaching girls from different public secondary schools across the state on how to protect themselves through martial arts. Bukola Olaba Opo, who is the commissioner in charge of the ministry, explained that violence against girl child must stop and one of the ways to put an end to it is to instill confidence in the girls. So now our girls will be starting now. We expect that when they come in, um, after about three months, they would have been able to defend themselves well and um, another set of girls would be taking in that until we are sure that we have enough girls in the state who can protect themselves. She says strategies in place to check gender violence in Ocean State. We launched a toll free line 293 to ensure that women and children who are in fear of danger or who are actually facing danger can speak to the government whether they have air time on their phone or not at no cost to them. And then when they call that number, Every strata of um, agencies of government who are involved in tackling GBV will rise up to the occasion. Director, Child Abuse Department of the Ministry, Jide Falade, advised them to be ICT compliant and stay away from bad company. The students were happy with the new method introduced to them. I've learned to be strong and I've learned to like, um, like the influence of society should not have influence on me. As a girl, you should not be ashamed of yourself. That you should be bold, you should stand up for yourself. Being able to learn that you should be able to defend yourself very well. The Osho State Ministry of Women, Children and Social Welfare says molestation and harassment campaign will be a continuous one.